A Little Tree Goes for Hajj Written and illustrated by Iman Salim Gather round, my saplings, for I have a wondrous tale to tell about a little tree and his traveling adventures, said the old tree in the great forest to his young students. Once, there was a little tree who dreamed of traveling around the world and meeting all sorts of other trees. But the place he wanted to go to most of all was Mecca, to see the Kaaba and to perform Hajj. How's a tree to travel? He thought, my roots are in the ground. His mother tree told him to make dua, pray. So the little tree made dua, asking Allah, God, to help him go for Hajj. He waited and waited and waited some more, always making dua. One day, a young man carrying a stick and a big bag walked by in a hurry. Where are you going? wondered the little tree. Are you talking to me? answered the young man. He wasn't used to talking trees. Yes, where are you going in such a rush? repeated the little tree. I am going down to the sea. There is a boat waiting to take me to Mecca. I am going to perform Hajj, inshallah, God willing. The little tree couldn't believe it. Are you going to see the Kaaba? he asked. Inshallah, yes, said the young man. Oh, I've always wanted to go to Mecca to make Hajj and see the beautiful Kaaba. You are very blessed, my friend, said the little tree. Alhamdulillah, praise be to God, agreed the young man. But if you don't mind me saying, I've never met a tree who talked and wanted to go to Mecca. The young man suddenly had a thought. Why don't you come with me? The little tree was so surprised. The thought of going to Mecca filled him with such excitement that his leaves began to tremble. You would take me with you? Yes, you are small and light. I will dig you out and carry you in this basket. But we have to hurry. I must ask my mother first, said the little tree. The little tree's mother agreed to let him go. The young man dug up the little tree and placed him gently in his basket. And so they set off in the boat to Mecca. During their voyage, they talked a lot and became very good friends. When they finally reached Mecca, the little tree exclaimed, Thank you, Allah, for such a wonderful gift. The man changed into ihram, clothing, and then he and the little tree began their hajj. Ihram clothing. When visiting the Kaaba on pilgrimage, people wear special clothes called ihram. For men, it is two white cloths wrapped around the body, and for women, it is usually a white dress and headscarf. The young man shaved his head and then trimmed off all the little tree's lovely green leaves. They returned to Mecca and finished their hajj by walking around the Kaaba, Tawaf. Alhamdulillah, this is the most fantastic time I have ever had, the little tree told the young man. When they finally returned home, the young man carefully planted the little hajj tree in his spot beside his mother. We had such an amazing time, the little tree told his mother. We prayed at the Kaaba, walked really fast between Al Safa and Al Marwa, and spent the entire day at Mount Arafat praying to Allah.
I wasn't able to throw any pebbles at the Jamarat three pillars, but my friend did it for me, and I drank some Zamzam water. The young man gave the mother tree a taste. Isn't it the sweetest water you have ever tasted? asked the little tree. Zamzam water is from a special well near the Kaaba. After that, the man would come to visit the little tree often, and any time he was going on an adventure, he would always take the little tree with him. Where is the little tree now? asked one of the saplings. The old tree paused, and at that moment, there was a sound in the forest. From behind a large oak tree, an old man with a stick came lumbering out. Assalamu alaikum, peace be with you, said the old man to the tree. Wa alaikum salam, and peace be with you, replied the old tree. Where are you off to today? Well, my friend, I'm tired of traveling, so I thought I would just rest by your roots today, answered the old man. The old man noticed the saplings eyeing him with curiosity. Assalamu alaikum, he greeted them. Have you ever heard the wondrous tale of the little tree who went for Hajj? The end.